Hey guys, this is Chad back in Mirror's Edge doing Chapter 7 Speedrun Achievement. Alright, what you want to do right off the bat is go ahead and drop down on the vent, jump across to the pole, jump down, go ahead and jump down again, roll, miss the roll here, of course, you always want to roll, and head right to the back of the truck, press the A button, and you're going to have a very long cutscene here, so, um, if you mess up this level a few times, I would play it multiple times, this long cutscene can get very frustrating, just letting you know that beforehand. The most difficult part on the entire level is coming right out of the truck, because you need to get to a certain point fast enough to where you're not going to get shot down. So, we'll break it up here, go ahead through, run right past everyone, go straight as fast as you can, jump right over here. There's a bunch of little shortcuts there, but they can mess you up, so I, I just take the normal way to just pop on the top of the truck and just try to move fast instead of trying to do any kind of tricky things. Run across the fence, go ahead, go down. Drop down, head straight forward to that, that side, take this guy's gun from behind, and then slow time here, shoot up that guy, shoot up the other one, drop the gun, head through the door. Long animation to do that. Then hit the door again. They will be shooting you here, but it won't be enough to take you down. But just keep on this path, no problems, no problems. This level is not extremely difficult, except that first part can get a little bit frustrating. That part where you come out of the truck. Alright, slow it down here for you. When you reach the top of the pole, you normally head left, head to the right, head to the top of the vent that glitches you through the top there and saves you a ton of time. Alright, down here, I'm going to miss this jump about five times, but it is such a good shortcut that I recommend practicing it and seeing if you can get it on the first try. Um, I probably wasn't worth the time with the five times I wasted, but I still was going for it, so you want a wall run, and then hit, once you hit the wall, LBRB LB on the top of that, and you should be able to get high enough to reach that, like I showed you that. And so wall run here, turn left, hop on top of the vent, just climb along, climb along, break through the vent, drop down, don't need to roll there. Another animation through the door. And to the left, go for another one. Probably load times here, loading new parts of the level, stuff like that. Head up the stairs. Much reach to the top of the stairs. LBRB LB across. Over the rail. Drop down. Another one of these. Very long time to take these. Alright, you're gonna get shot here, one across, pretty much every time. Slide underneath, slide underneath, climb up top, head across the rail. Wall run up to the top of the ladder saves you maybe a couple extra seconds. Head to the left side here. Now, it's be careful not to jump too far to the left or else you fall off the edge, and make sure you stick into the right there because you can slide off of it as well. Right here, ignore me, ignore me, I'm just trying to trick something, so just ignore it. Just do do this part right at the beginning. Head to the left and just climb up the side there. Saves you more time. Here you have to fight this uh, killer, and you need to avoid her kicks, which you should be sliding and kicking and, kick and punching after you hit her once right there. And as soon as the gun turns red, you want to hit the Y button in order to cause the animation to happen there. And then you can go ahead and keep continue on with the level. Go over the rail, drop down, head to the right, and another one of these animations taking a very long time for these. So as you through, head to the left, left again, and another one. Shocking, I know. Not to do that. Head over the rail on the right, just keep running just full sprint. Slide underneath there, you're not gonna make it full sprint. Chop on top of the truck. Jump on top, LB, RB, LB, up to the pole across, and head straight to the right, and jump over the pole again. And just keep following the killer. Nothing too difficult there. She's gonna shoot at these things, shoot at these uh, vents on you or whatever. Jump over the first one, the second one you can just run right through. Turn and LB, RB, LB again. Go faster, I could have done that better. Head over the rail, drop down, slide down the zip line, head across. Nothing really too difficult there, jump on top of the truck, cross, and you got to fight the killer again. This will be the second time, not any more difficult, just the same amount of difficulty in order to do this again. And you want to follow the same exact thing, you know, slide, kick, and then punches, and wait till the gun turns red, and then you can disarm her and cause the end of the level. Not too difficult at all, you should, you have plenty of time to make lots of mess ups. So there you go. Thanks for watching guys, and uh, see you next time.